my fellow humans, it's Doc Martin from Science Museum Oklahoma, and welcome back to my home lab. You may have seen this cool demonstration that shows you the importance of using soap against dirt, germs, and viruses. In this bowl, I have some water. I'm going to add a little pepper to the top to represent germs. In the other bowl, I have some dish soap. Once I stick my finger in the dish soap and stick it in the bowl with the water, the germs run away. Now this is just a matter of surface tension, but how does soap actually protect us from dirt, germs, and viruses? Soap is created by combining salts from fats or oils and an alkali, such as sodium or potassium hydroxide, in a process known as saponification. The same molecules that work together to wash away dirt and oil from our hands are very similar to the fats that make up the outer shell or membrane of a virus. The outer shell of my virus is represented by the purple cups. Now those fats in soap work to break down that outer membrane, causing the virus to fall apart and become inactive. Washing your hands with just water might work, but it's not as good at breaking down the strong glue-like bonds between your hands and germs and viruses. Soap not only breaks down those bonds, but it also breaks down the viruses to make them inactive. So washing your hands with soap and water is your best bet. Thank you so much for joining me today. I've been Doc Martin from Science Museum Oklahoma, and we'll see you all next time.